Hey y'all, I'm back and it's a makeup video, so we're just going to get right into it. I'm going to spray my face with my primer, and if you hear that noise in the background, I apologize. The people downstairs for me are moving. Okay, to start, I would like to always start with my eyebrows. I like to brush those out and then go ahead and use my pencil and outline them and then go in with the pomade, which is the easiest way to do it for me. All of the products that I'll be using in this video are very affordable, I will say that, and they will all be listed in the description. As you can see, I did outline them first, as I said, and you just take the pomade and you want to fill them in. So outline them first and get them really crispy, and then take your pomade and fill them in and brush them back out to have that, you know, flawless look. Concealer, concealer. I know that some people use a lighter shade on the bottom and a darker shade on the top for it's easy because it's easier to blend. However, that's not the look that I was going for today. I do like for my eyebrows so it's a certain type of way, so that's why I use the same concealer on top and bottom. And you'll see how it turns out, man. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. When I say this is the best Maybelline foundation that I ever used, I only used that little bit and it was like full coverage. It was everything. So I'm definitely gonna list that in the description so y'all can get y'all lives just like me. Okay, and to highlight, I'm going to use the same concealer that I use under my eyes to go ahead and highlight those areas as you see as I'm jamming to my, um, who is that, Nikki? I'm sure it's Nikki. Lil Baby too can't forget about him, but I am going to blend my concealer. I did spray my beauty blender to get it a little damp, you know. Who uses a dry beauty blender? Like, that's crazy. So go ahead, blend those. Blend those. Blend your concealer out and get ready to contour. And to contour, when I say you can use anything, you can use anything. Like you can literally use a little dab of brown eyeshadow on a brush. Because you know what? I don't have any more and that's what I just did and it came out perfect so you can use anything don't let these people convince you that you gotta have these expensive products because you don't Y'all know I go heavy under the eyes because I like it to look a little lighter but not ashy if you know what I mean. Can 
we just take a minute to get into this lace and how flawless it's laying, it's melted, it's everything. And the colors that I'll be using today is Desert Vibes and Security, which is on top. I feel like I've been baking forever, but it's finally time to remove the setting powder and dust that off. Make sure you dust it very well because you do not want flashbacks. Even if you have to test it in your camera in the dark with the flash, do what you gotta do, sis. A no lie, I'm getting better and better with this eyeliner. I've never like done my eyeliner as I'm recording. I usually cut this part out, but I want y'all to see my progress. One thing I will say, I feel like uh, eyeliner underneath the eyes brings the complete look together. Like eyeliner is everything on top, but the eyeliner underneath brings it together. I ain't gonna hold y'all. I wasn't even a blush girl, but now lately I've been doing my makeup with the blush, and I've been getting so many compliments on my makeup. So I'm assuming it's the blush because that's the only thing that I was doing different. I wasn't using as much blush, but now I'm doing. I'm starting out to be a little so light on the hands. I'm just saying Next up, are you really crazy, bro? You're not supposed to mix those Do say and I'm holy, yo You act the fool in my car, then go I'm forced to let it go Have it your way, for sure I'm yours, that's how 
Okay, now for y'all favorite part, the highlighter. This is the highlighter I got out of an Ipsy bag a while back. It is called Tetris. It is so bright, it's like really, really gold. So be careful with it. Camera died, but I'm back. So I'm just gonna go in and do my lips, line my lips, go in with my Pink Cosmo Lip Plumper from e.l.f. Love that. Camera's losing focus, okay, bring it back. Okay, we're good, let's go. So after I apply my lip gloss, my makeup is pretty much finished. The only thing I need to do is put my clothes on and do my hair and I'm out the door. So I would like to thank you all for watching this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, thumbs up this video, follow me on Instagram at I am Ari Monique, and tell me what you think of this look on a scale of 1 to 10 in the comments. Thank you and I'll see you all in the next video.